listen to me, I relax, float. You feel that feeling where you I block, I, I pluck, and she's floating. We come here and we pluck her this way. Oh. Other Tai Chi teachers say you could hit them with your hand, mm -hmm. you push them with your arm and... Mm -hmm. We're gonna talk about single whip and how it's used. One of the really fun things about single whip is that it's the Tai Chi movement that most distinctly uses the, the hook hand, right? What is a hook hand for? It's a very effective way of having the yin quality be expressed in Tai, in plucking. Mm. <clears throat> so let, let's just talk, uh, let me just show you what, it, what I mean by that. So if you were pushing into me, right? And I've neutralized your arm in some way. So here, when my hand touches here, and I apply the plucking, I'll gain control of her body energy by, by the chai. So let's come here. She pushes into me. So this is a normal neutralizing, and she still has control to some extent. She pushes into me. I relax, float. You feel that feeling where your whole body becomes light mm -hmm. and, and influence, right? Mm -hmm. So the hook hand, did I squeeze you very hard? Nope. Nope. How hard did I squeeze you? Just touching. That's the super valuable clue. Just just touching. I just want to grab her skin mm -hmm. and I like kind of lift and drag her skin. And that makes her body um, awareness and energy all flow to the surface where I can control it. So mm -hmm. stand still for a second, stand strong. Okay. Don't let me pull you. Okay. So it's not easy to pull you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now stand still just like that. Don't let me move you. I'm just going to grab her skin. See like this. Mm. So easy to move you, isn't yeah. it? What did it feel like when you got moved? My skin fascia is going. Yeah, out. so I like to think of it like I'm picking up a kitty, kitty cat by the mm -hmm. their skin. You know, I'm not trying to hurt, hurt or scare this mm -hmm. kitty cat. I'm just gently mm -hmm. doing that. So it's the first part, single whip, demonstrates that mm -hmm. that plucking. Okay, and then the next part is a finishing. Like I said, there's techniques in Tai Chi can be for for the first initial engagement with them, the transitions from the engage, engagement, which is what this is, and there can be a finishing technique that you do to help you win the win the confrontation. So this part is the, the, la the last part. So let's suppose she punches me, okay? So I'm gonna defend her here, and this hand come, I'm gonna pluck her from under, like this, and we're gonna do this. Okay, sorry, let's start again, you punch. So I block, I, I pluck, and she's floating. We come here, and we pluck her this way. Oh, okay, so we, um, and off they go. <laughs> you okay? All right, so that's single whip. Let me show you okay. slow. She punches, we block. I make sure this hand doesn't punch me. I may, I'm safe, I'm gonna take this. I just barely grab the skin and I float her to here. Once we're here, I'm behind her. I come around. I'm gonna take this hand and touch the skin of her face, either here or here, and roll that. See, it's a very light motion, isn't it? But once again, we're using the splitting effect on the surface of her body to disrupt her balance. Mm -hmm. Stand like this for a second. Be strong and balanced. And don't let me pull your head. See, it's not necessarily easy to pull her off balance like this. But if I just barely get her skin like this, see how, isn't it hard to resist that? Why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> because you know how to fight with your muscles. Yes. You don't know how to fight with your skin, do you? You no. never trained to be a, a snake. <laughs> not really. <clears throat> so you don't know how to resist the forces that are just mm -hmm. applied to your skin, mm -hmm. you know? And you know, it's just like sometimes someone pull your hair and you're like, you panic, you don't know how to stop that because mm -hmm. that's a different way of being controlled that you're not familiar mm -hmm. with. So it's some kind of somewhat similar to that. I'm manipulating you by the skin of your face. So, so this portion, you can do a number of things. I'm sure you've seen other Tai Chi teachers say you could hit them with your hand, mm -hmm. you push them with your arm and mm -hmm. those are all valid. I just want to show a different use in which I'm using this part to rotate mm -hmm. you. So you punch me again over here like this, from here I pluck. Blow them. We come here and we guide the skin over and they'll lose their balance and mm -hmm. you can guide them to the ground or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, you can do it from the inside. Come again. I could be here like this and then I float her here like this and then from here we guide her around and over. Oh. <laughs> no control. You want to try on me? <laughs> yes. So I um, yeah. let's go like this. You block my punch. Okay. It's a very standard kind of block. Okay. You take this you roll my skin around, okay, lightly, so that I lose my balance. This is gonna come around. Right I'm a bit taller than you, so if you can't reach my head, mm -hmm. you could just go my shoulder and then roll that back like that. Oh. That's the that's the feeling. Um, so not. Gliding. Yeah, everything everything is a light light so contact. Yeah, punch me. See, everything everything is a light light contact. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not not strong, cause actually mm -hmm. punch me. If if I was pulling you hard 
okay? And forcing your heart, see, you can resist that pretty well. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's when it's light like this, that it starts to disorient your body. I see. Yeah, any questions about this? A lot of questions, you know? <laughs> <laughs> which we're, ask anything. So soft is better. Soft is better because soft is like, like a mist mm. that you don't know how to deal with. Yes. If I make it hard and obvious, yes. you know that's where the, the problem is. If you're strong enough, you will overcome it. So I don't want to, I don't want to confront your strength. Mm. I'm, I'm, I'm like a, a cotton candy, I'm mm. like smoke. You cannot tell where the power is coming from. Mm. You feel like you're lost in the fog. You feel like you're floating up against your will mm. and then, then you're on the ground. That's mm. what we, the type of experience we want you to have. Yeah. We apply it to you. So you you are not let me react. I will not let you react with the, this one too. Yes. So I'm confusing. You're, what you're conf yeah. yeah. What's going on? Yeah. Then as I confuse, you're doing all this way. Yeah, because you're skilled and you're strong. If I let you react with your body, with your intellect, you will overcome me, and we don't want it. We don't want that to happen. Ah, yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good questions. Thanks for asking. Thanks for helping me demonstrate. See you next time.